Hello, in this video we're going to look at the logo section of the custom login page. Now the logo image is connected to the media library so you can upload files into the media library in the normal way or you can use files already in the media library. You also obviously have the editing facilities of the media library as well. Um, so let's choose a logo. I'm going to choose this logo here. No, I'm not. That's the small one. 80. Yeah, this is the big one. And this one is 80 by 80. So I want this image here. But this image is actually um, big. It's too big, really. And also, if you have a look at it, there's some white space underneath which is wasted. So you're able to use all the functions of media. So if I can grab it, there it is. I'll move that up just a little bit and hit the crop button and then save. I want to remove that white space for me. So if I insert that into the post now, the white space is not there. That's good. But this will be resized to the width of the login box. So if I just remind you, the login box here, the width of that is what the image will be resized to. So I've hit Save Changes to apply it and then refresh this. Oh, I don't know. Worry about login error incorrect logins. There we are. So the image to put at the top, there's a 10 pixel space put at the uh, gap between just to lay them out a bit. So that's the logo image. Uh, if you don't like that logo image, you can remove it. Set logo image and choose another one. Choose one for the WP Business Club, why not? Again, save changes and then refresh and that will now be the logo image. Okay, and that one's a very big one so it's blurred quite badly as it's been squashed. If you've got an image that's too big it's just going to use up bandwidth so I do advise you to edit it and make one that's reasonably the uh, same size. You're going to ask me what the size of this, this width is again in a second, aren't you? And um, it's actually a figure we can change. So we'll just have a quick look in the login box, which is actually part of another training, but you see the form width is usually 340 pixels, but it can be changed. Let's go back to the logo. Um, mind you, the logo width is fixed the form box width. But that is all you need to do really for the uh, login logo. Thanks for watching.